This little video goes with my Home Depot review of the Bond Arabella Fountain. Um, if you'd like more information, just uh, read my review on Home Depot. So it's very beautiful, as you can see. It's an indoor-outdoor fountain. Um, it, it only comes in two pieces plus the um, pump for the fountain. So it's this bottom piece here, and it's all metal. This is metal. Um, and it holds quite a bit of water. Um, so this is open box, and I, I posted pictures on my review so you can see better what it looks like. There's a hole in the back for the cord for, for the pump there. So, um, the, and the cord is quite long. Um, then this piece with the flowers on it. Um, and the plate that's that sits on little slots here and there's a tube that runs down on the bottom of the plate to the pump now I don't know if it's just mine or if they're all like this but the tube is too short to reach the pump all the way to the floor um, it, it barely makes it so it makes closing it up extremely difficult so what I did was I put some water in it first and then I stuck the pump to the side. And so that made the, it easier for the tube to connect with ease. And then I, I finished filling it. And you know, you can fill it up just by dumping the water right here on top of the plate. So I put, I connected it and then set the plate down and um, finished pouring the water over the top. If you don't put enough water in, it has a real hollow sound like someone's in the bathroom tinkling so you want to make sure you put enough water in um, it's really really pretty and I love the sound of flowing water so as you can see um, these are a little flexible which makes it I think it makes it more you know uh, prettier I don't know so um, I don't want to put mine outside because where I live it's really humid and with the humidity it'll make algae and all that stuff and I don't want to end up starting to put chemicals and stuff in it so for me um, to leave it in the house is real nice have that nice ambience of flowing water but as far as how well it's made it's made really well the, the bottom is put together well these pieces you know it looks like they're all welded on uh, um, you know, they look like they're actually growing out of the bottom. Um, the pump is pretty solid. The cord is really thick and heavy duty. So would I recommend it? Absolutely. It's beautiful. The color is beautiful. It's a nice bronzy color, which will go with anything. Um, I might end up putting this upstairs where the bedrooms are, um, you know, for peaceful sleep. Now, the pump has uh, lows, mediums, and high settings. So... You may have to adjust. I did have to adjust. I had it on high, but it was splashing on the wall. So, and you know, not even that much, but after it was on for a while, I could see the water spots started. So I, I turned it down a little bit and that kind of seemed to help. So, um, you know, you might want to think about where you're going to put it. If you're going to put it outside, no problem, but if you're going to put it in, you know, I might think about putting like a little plexiguard or something um, or just turning it down a little more you know and and the more the, the softer the flow the quieter it is too so but anyway it, it is it's it's beautiful and I love it I love the way each flower flows into each flower and there's a little I don't know if you can see it maybe in this one there's like a little spongy pad inside each one so it, it kind of looks like a, a sunflower center, like it has a, a center to each flower, lily pad, whatever. But um, so pretty. It's so pretty. Um, I'm really surprised at how beautiful it is. So I love it, and I do recommend it so much. Okay. It's the Bond Arabella Fountain.